Our other top story here at five for weeks. We've been tracking the lack of ambulances on the streets in Detroit ready to respond. Well, what happened today is really going to help address that 90 new recruits graduated as firefighters and EMTs, and some of them are already on the job. Sean Lay is live tonight. And Sean, what are you hearing about numbers? Well, we talked about 90 recruits. We'll talk about those numbers of 90 recruits. We'll talk about that impact. But look, we're talking about a manpower situation this department has struggled with all year long. Ambulance crews like this one, the doors shut, the ambulance inside, no one to staff them, meaning response time severely impacted. So 90 new recruits today, but here's the deal. We went to graduation. Many of those recruits were not there today because they were already on the street on the job. Carter Ferris's goal is to save lives. It made me really think that, hey, I can really do that too. Ferris is one of 90 brand new Detroit firefighters and Detroit EMTs, the latest class of recruits graduating today. But if you listen closely to Ferris, he's already been on the job with DFD for two weeks. This is only my second week in the field and I've seen a lot, I've done a lot, I've learned so much and I understand that I still have a lot to learn. Recruits responding to fires, recruits in ambulances responding to emergencies weeks before graduation, a sign the department is struggling with staffing. We've investigated and detailed how many veteran medics say they were overworked, underpaid, and left the department. That up to a dozen Detroit fire ambulances were left out of service on different days, not enough medics or EMTs to staff them, having a dangerous impact on ambulance response time. Today, we learned that some graduates Graduates are already on the job, and some graduates today got right into an ambulance to respond to emergencies after the ceremony. Some of them actually couldn't make it today because they're working, boots to the ground. Some of them are on duty today. Back your life. Some on duty, not going to graduation. Others, after graduation, walked out and got right to work in an ambulance. Look, guys, we've been investigating this for months after months, the lack of EMTs and ambulances on the street. And we would said, we said, uh, the city would say, help is on the way. We say we'd be there to highlight that as well when help is on the way. That is today. More recruits and ambulances now, full fledged firefighters and EMTs. Also, the city working with a private ambulance company to beef up numbers during the summer months. We're live in Detroit. Sean Lake, local four. Back hope to you. It helps. Okay, Sean. Thank you.